Hello everybody and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox 2 video and today we are checking out the oldest version of the game which I could get working so this is actually Universe Sandbox 11.3 so yeah this is a long way back back in 2014 as you can see there because yeah the current version is Alpha 19.3 so this is a really really old build and I haven't actually got into it to explore what's going on here so from first impressions this is quite a slow like a slow game so I'm assuming back in the day they had some issues um, running the simulations when it was playing because it, when I play it it's fine but when I pause it or sorry when I pause it it's fine but when I play it it's really really slow so I'm assuming the asteroid belt here is the main issue I wonder if I can use the current controls to delete oh I can I just deleted it well, okay that's, let's try and play it and there's also one thing it says no music which kind of sucks I love the universe sandbox music wow the time speeds up a lot quicker damn that speeds up very very fast alright so as we look here, all of the options are completely different as well. It's, it's pretty cool. Oh, the sun has a noise. That's like the normal noise it usually has. So we can edit it. Oh, it looks so weird like this. Because, oh, wow. Oh, and they've got all of the options here. That's pretty interesting. Because in the latest build, you can't get carbon dioxide and organics anymore. You used to be able to get organics, but I've never seen an option for carbon dioxide before. So interesting stuff, actually. Because I've never had the option to play of Carbon Dioxide since I started playing. Because I started playing in, I think it was 2015, I want to say, or 2016. It's definitely one of those two. And yeah, there was no area to add Carbon Dioxide in the materials area. So, pretty interesting stuff. So, I wanna, I actually want to check out if there's any music. So, everything here is so weird. Like, all the... It's completely... Just completely different. Okay, so there is audio, but it doesn't seem like there's any music. So... Yeah, this game must be very, very weird at some point. Um, what's up with Mercury here? Let's go on here. Okay, so I want to actually have a play around with this and see if anything's different. From from what I've seen, if you actually um, mess around with this enough, like, so let's say add some hydrogen, I think the actual planet goes... Um, I think it like looks different when you add gases. Oh, see, look at that. That's a cool effect that we don't get. Look at that, that's cool. So it's like almost, it's not a gas giant yet, but you can you can basically see the clouds, but the surface below. I really wish they did this in the current game, because that's pretty cool. So you can still sort of see the surface below there, but you also have this cloud layer, it's so cool. So let's just actually speed this up a lot. We'll do it with all the planets as well, just to see all of the different looks. So let's completely fill it up with hydrogen and see if it completely changes. So we're at 100% hydrogen now, but is anything gonna happen, I wonder? So. Is it going to warm up? We can um, speed up the time here as well. So is anything going to happen? Oh, it's warming up. Whoa, whoa, it is. Was it warming up? Oh, no, no, it's not. Okay, it got cold for some reason. So it's now it's a gas giant. So that's pretty, pretty interesting stuff there. So let's pause it again. Pause, please. Is it? Is it pause? Pause. Come on, pause. Um, I think it. we've sort of messed the game up a bit. <laughs> All right, let's just open a new simulation up if we can. Um... Restart simulation, there we go, we'll just press that one there. Let's see, look how slow these, this runs, it's just ridiculous. Alright, so let's pause it. Please pause, pause. There we go, now delete all of those objects, now hit play again. And let's try this, we just saw what Mercury looks like as a gas giant. Whoa, Venus, what's up with this? It was very... Why is it like that? Wait. That is peculiar, we can't see it's like cloud, we only see the surface. Can we, like, do anything? Okay, that, that's not the option. Well, Venus is looking very peculiar. Because we can see its atmosphere and its surface at the same time, I guess. Alright. Okay, let's try um, adding some... Um, actually, we could try carbon dioxide. What about that? Does that make it... Oh, it just makes it the same as hydrogen. Look at that. That's a cool effect. Oh, there's a bit of a line there. That's a little weird. But look at that. That's actually pretty cool. I wish we could do stuff like this now, but it's not in the game. So there's a bunch of carbon dioxide there, I guess. So that's going to get pretty hot, I'm assuming. So let's actually play around with the temperature as well. Will it actually um, make like a cool looking effect? Let's say we put it up to 300 maybe. Does that do anything? Okay, no, no, no. What am I saying? We've got to put it up higher than that. Let's do 700. Alright, it just resets it down again. Wait, what if we keep it paused and then do 700? Okay, there we go. You can see it's warming up there. Okay, so we'll leave it paused and see how it will look. So it starts to glow, but... I think as time progresses, it gets a really cool look to it. So, is anything here going to happen? It looks... Hmm, interesting. Oh, it's slow down time as well. And now hits hit play. Oh, it just went down again. Okay. That's weird. Alright, let's actually increase its mass so it becomes like a brown dwarf star. So, let's make its mass about... 
I don't know, 100, 100 Jupiters maybe? See, look at that. That is a cool effect. It's like a, that is like a brown dwarf sort of effect. Like, that's really cool. I really wish, like, brown dwarfs in the current game looked like that. Because that looks, like, really awesome. Wait, if we do 110, does it, like, change? So that, now that's a star. So if we, um, continue to lower it, let's try and get a breast. So that's the largest brown dwarf we can pretty much get here. So, cool, I like it. Okay, so, let's see what Earth looks like with these weird, like, clouds. So, let's, um, pause it. Oh, Earth looks really different in this version of the game, actually, as well. So... Look at that, that's so weird, like how the clouds just like vent it all out and make it look like all like messed up, it's pretty cool. Okay, let's go to Mars now and see what it looks like. I really want to see what this looks like of all of the planets. And let's do Mars. Oh, and actually there's an interesting thing here as well, I've just thought about it. We didn't know what Pluto looked like when this version of the game was out, so Pluto probably doesn't have the texture it has now. And Mars looks really, really red here, wow. In the current game it looks more pink, but that is proper red, I like that. That's pretty cool. Right, so let's see what it looks like, the clouds. And there we go, so we've got like a really like crazy looking Mars. Oh, I like that. Uh, that's, that's pretty cool. Alright, so we can't really do it with Jupiter or Saturn or anything like that, because they're already gas giants. Like, it's already made of hydrogen and stuff, so... Yeah, we can't do anything with those, but I want to see what Pluto looks like. So, Pluto, where are you at? Well, Pluto doesn't have a custom colour, because in the current game it has like a creamish colour. Like, this is blue. Oh, here it is. Apparently it's a terrestrial planet, but... Pluto has no custom texture here. Oh, wow, this is so old. Wow, okay, let's add carbon to that. Is that a new thing? We've got a cool gas giant sort of style. It's like a black gas giant. That's pretty cool. Okay. Oh, it's just, just, this is just like really weird seeing this. So, why, why does Mercury continue to get ejected all the time? That's like a glitch in this old version of the game, I guess. Okay, so let's just um, play around with this a little more. Because I don't want to make this video too long. So, let's mess it up with the sun a bit. We'll it. Carbon, what about a carbon sun? The carbon dark side. That'd be interesting. Alright, let's double its mass as well, so... There we go, let's put it up to uh, 2,000 jupes, pretty much. Oh, it blew up! Okay, that's a pretty big supernova there. Okay, let's speed this up a little more. Okay, so the game actually runs supernovas not that bad at this point. And did everything just got disintegrated, everything. So we don't even have the um, any planets left, so that completely destroyed it. That's what supernovas should be, because in the current version of the game, they don't do that. So. What other simulations are in here? Oh! Oh, it's got my new simulations in here. I really shouldn't open those. Because old opening the new version of the simulation in an old version of the game, yeah, I'm definitely not going to open those. I do not want to mess this up, so... Okay, activities. What's, what are these? Introduction. Welcome to the Universe Sandbox Alpha. Okay, let's see what we got in here. Oh my god, that is... We've got to delete those particles there. Uh, Alright. So, okay, so, pause, select a planet, okay, Earth, okay, all the tutorials are like, all different, properties, um, okay, close the properties window, okay, chart mode, oh, this still exists, okay, this is really old, two years back in the day, oh my god, oh wow, look at, the, look at Neptune and Uranus, they look different, I like that look for Neptune, actually, even Saturn looks different. So Jupiter looks pretty much the same as it does in the current game, but Saturn, Neptune, and Uranus here, they all look different. Like, their textures are different. They look like more cloud, like, there's more lines, they're more visible. I guess in the current version of the build, they're more smooth, I guess. Is that the way to say it? Alright, so, click on the standard, um, standard button. Where, where's that? Um, is it closed? Do I do this? What does it mean by, arrange all these different properties, chosen the charts with it. When you're done, click on the standard button. Which one's the standard button? Um. Oh. I've just pressed something. Oh, there are many included simulations to explore. Okay, let's see this. So, open. Click on the name of the simulation. Okay, I don't want to open any of those, so. Okay, here we go. So, we'll just open, um. Solar systems and major moons, I guess. Let's have a look at this. Right, is this going to work? Or is it going to crash the game? Please don't crash. Wow, the game is really slow here. Oh, here we go. Alright, cool. So we got it loaded up. Oh, wow. It's a great job. Wow, this is so slow. We delete those asteroids again. There's that. It's mainly the asteroid belt which is causing all these issues. This may have not been the best simulation to open. <laughs> Come on, close. Oh, oh, the game. Oh, wow, it almost went. The game almost crashed. Run performance test. Okay. So let's just see what it's going to do here. 
So it looks different to the current performance test in the game because I definitely don't recognize this. So interesting. So let's just see how this plays out and how well or actually run this because the current version of the game definitely runs a lot easier than this version does. So let's see how this works out. All the atmospheres are so weird as well. They don't like cover up the whole planet. You only see it at the sides there. If you look carefully on the right hand side of those, see look at the pink planet on the left or the purple planet on the bottom left there. You can't see the atmosphere across the whole planet. You only see it on the sides or like the edges of the planet. If you get what I mean there, it looks definitely doesn't look right. All right, let's see what we got next. Oh, we got Earth and many moons there. One of the oldest simulations in the game, actually. Hmm. Excuse me, I just had a quick drink. All right, so looking good. So this doesn't seem like it's running um too bad actually. I thought it'd run worse than this. I guess it's just the asteroid belts which are really really buggy in this and so slow. All right, what have we got next? Anything coming up? We're just stuck. Oh. Oh my god, the galaxy collision. Okay. Here's where the stuff up. Look how slow this is running. This is just this is just crazy. Like, even the galaxies look different. That's pretty pretty cool actually. So Yeah. This is really, really slow. Let's hope this simulation disappears quickly because not looking too good here, so Wow, that is so slow. In the current version of the game I run this no problem. That's pretty pretty amazing just how much they've improved the game over the years because at one point it was just awful and emergency services please be quiet <laughs> I don't know if you just had that fire truck go by there but oh well so let's see here uh, still playing this <laughs> damn this is crazy yeah they definitely uh, definitely credit to the team where credit's due like they have really improved the game because my PC is a good PC and even it can't run this like that is m just mad I'm guessing they just found ways to make it less slow I guess like maybe they found ways to the particles in this to like all become one object instead of those little objects I, I have no idea how they do it I do not know how to program all I know is how to actually use the game or, get, or if you call it a game is it a game you don't win or lose so would it be a game I don't know yeah tell me what you guys think is it a game or do you say it's more of a sandbox sort of game it's like Minecraft almost like sandbox you do what you want it's not really like you don't really win or lose almost oh, I don't know all right anyways in fact, actually, while this simulation is playing out, I just can't. I gotta thank you guys as well because the sub subscriber count we're almost at 600 already. Like that is just crazy. I can't thank you guys enough for all the support and the likes and the comments and obviously the people who subscribe as well. It's much, much, much appreciated. And yeah, hopefully the simulation will eventually disappear. All right, finally it's going. All right, what have we got next? Let's see. Come on, load. All right. Well, we've got an old version of Earth. Okay, it looks like we've got some asteroids going to collide with Earth. See, Earth looks so weird like that. Oh, it's getting its water up here. And it's probably going to lose all of its water now as these, um... Okay, yeah, a lot of these objects hit it. Oh, poor Earth. About to get barraged by all these... Oh, look at the impacts! Whoa, they look so different as well. I've never actually explored this, like I said earlier, so... Wow. I've got to do that again in a quick... Another simulation. Those, those explosions are so different to what we have now. Okay, interesting. Cool. Alright, what have we got next? So this is definitely different to the current one. Oh, there we go. So my score is 83.75. No idea what that means. I'm guessing that's how good I am. I, I don't know. Alright, so let's actually just delete that. Alright, so let's go to Earth again. I really want to see... I want to collide some stuff of it, so... Um, add. There we go. Okay, so let's see what the um, actual... Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, it's got all my custom... I'd better not add any of these custom objects in because they could mess it up as well. So let's just see what's in the database, maybe. Oh, wait, is it, what does database even mean? <laughs> I don't know. Let's close my objects. Okay. Whoa, okay. Wait, is that Mercury? That doesn't look like Mercury. Looks completely different. Venus? Wow, this is ridiculous. Okay. So, wait, at this point in the game, they didn't even have... cut. You couldn't even spawn in the custom-looking... Oh, you can do it with the gas giants. But you could not spawn in the custom looking rocky planets. Because like, look, if you just try and spawn Mercury, it just spawns a random object. And Venus as well, random object. Earth looks like a random... Yeah, Earth's random. And Mars, that's not a red planet. Okay, so let's um, just get a random moon, maybe. Let's place it here. And I want to see it collide with Earth. So let's slow down the time here. Okay, so seven minutes a second. Is it... Wow, it didn't collide. Okay, um... Where's edit mode? Okay, that edit mode still exists. Alright, perfect. Okay, let's try it there. And turn edit mode off, please. I'll start and select. There we go. Alright, so now let's... Okay, now let's hit play. Okay, so we want to we wanna do this slow. I want to see this in action. Alright, so we're in seconds now. Let's slow this down. 
Well, it looks like what's that red effect? There? That's pretty interesting. Wait, let's just pause that quick. Um, wait, what's that with the Earth's day and night cycle? Wait, is this? We only have one star in here, right? Yeah, we do. So why does Earth's day and night cycle really? Why is it like that? That's peculiar. But look at this like red effect. That's like a sunset. I'm assuming like sunsets. That is cool. I like like that. I'm guessing that's like sunset area. I'm assuming. All right, so let's actually see this. And now let's um, speed up a little more. Okay. Okay, here we are. So let's see what the impact in the old version of the game looks like in slow motion. All right, so let's see what we got. Okay, nothing's happening. Game, are you going to work? What? It just going straight through the earth. Um, okay. No idea. Okay, let's just go to a new simulation here. Let's, um, let's go to, uh, let's get earth again. Oh, wait, wait, what's meant to be earth? Although it does spawn in the custom earth. Okay, now it works. Okay, that's interesting why I didn't do it earlier. Okay, let's try, um, let's try that maybe. Does that work? Um, no explosion. Like that. Uh, can we? Oh, there we go, there we go. Whoa! Okay, looking cool. Okay, let's actually try that again. I want to get it, I really want to get it in slow motion. Okay, so it does work. Okay, so new simulation. Let's, um, close my objects again. Okay, so let's get a new earth. Okay, so there we are. Alright, now let's get a Mars and let's place it there. So is it going to go into Earth, please? Please can I collide with Earth, come on. Please? Can we, um, I don't know, mess with it a bit? Okay, looking good, okay. So it's, um, okay, we're going to do it in slow motion this time, I promise. <laughs> Alright, so, let's um, quickly slow this down. Okay, so let's just do it with Neptune, actually. Neptune's my favourite planet. Yeah, I don't know if I, I don't know if it looks as good as it used to though, or in the current version of the game. I, th I definitely think it looks better in the current version of the game. All right, so let's slow down the time first, then we'll put an Earth in. All right, so um, add objects. If we want to get um, Earth, uh, please Earth. Let's get it here. And if you don't know what that is, that's my Earth from the future. That's like the Earth in one billion years, how it looked like. So if you didn't know, all right, Earth, please add. Okay. Um, no motion, that's what we want. Alright, so now we put an Earth here, place it. Okay, so now it should collide with Neptune. Okay, so let's speed up the time a little more. Now is it going to collide with Neptune? I really want to see this. Okay, it's increasing the speed, perfect. Alright, so, speed this up more. And there's a lot of things that aren't in the game right now as well, so, pretty cool stuff. And also, if you guys want me to do more episodes on the old version of the game, leave a comment down below right now and tell me what I should do, because, yeah, we could get some different outcomes in the old version of the game. It'd be interesting to see, so... Let's do this. Okay, so we're about to collide with Neptune any second now. Look at that red, that like red area there. That looks cool. Okay, so Earth is now getting completely engulfed by Neptune. That red ring looks really nice. I like that. As we can see, the games like can't barely survive. I think that's why it's going red here. As you can see, look, the minutes per second is going red. I mean, it doesn't do that in the current version of the game. Interesting. Whoa. So if you can hear that, the um, collision um, collision sound effect is continue playing here, so interesting, okay. And Earth is no more, so we've just got a bunch of Neptune fragments now, and half of Neptune is completely just burnt out almost, so let's see this. Can we get a good look here? Edit, can we um, see? Launch fireworks, what does that do? Oh, that's in the current version of the game, that's nothing new, I just never use it. Alright, so let's um, slow this down again. And also, I don't think anyone else has done a video on this as well, actually, is it? Someone tell me if someone else has made a video on going back to an old version, but I don't think anyone has. Am I the first to do this? That's pretty cool, isn't it? Alright, All right. I have no idea. Alright, so there we are. Looking good. Alright, so Neptune now just looks horrible with all these impact marks. Let's speed this up a little more. And Neptune will just eat up all of its fragments. So there we go, we've got tons of bruises on Neptune now. It's looking pretty horrible. So let's, what's this yellow area here? It's like all... It's all the wrong colour. <laughs> Alright, so, um, there we go, I guess. We're, we're done. Alright, so if you guys, um, like I said, if you guys any have any ideas for, for what me to do in this old version of the game, because this is the oldest version of the game I could get. I know I can, I know Steam says I can get to Alpha 6, but it won't load when I hit play. So, yeah, this is the oldest version I could get running. So, pretty cool stuff, I guess. So, um, hopefully you guys all enjoyed. And, wait, did I just see a uh, moon go by Neptune there? Even though it doesn't even have any moons. Wait, did I actually see that? Yeah, look there. If you look carefully, there is a moon 
going past Neptune on the right there. Look, you see it there. Is it going to do it again? There was, yeah, look, that little black dot. Why is that there? Is that, maybe it's just one of these impact marks, but I think that looks like a shadow more than an impact mark. Interesting. That's, that is definitely a moon. I'm sorry, that is a moon. I'm sure it is. All right, so, yeah, there we go, guys. Um, like I said, hopefully you all enjoyed this video. If you've got any ideas for what I should do in an older version of the game, or if you've got any other ideas in general, which I play in the latest version, then, yeah, just leave a comment down below. Subscribe if you're new. Make sure you all have a good day. And I'll see you in the next, um, blubber, I messed up my outro, oh well. So I'll see you in the next video, guys, and yeah, goodbye. Hello everybody, and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox 2 video, and today... We are checking out the oldest version of the game which I could get working. So this is actually Universe Sandbox 11.3. So yeah, this is a long way back, back in 2014 as you can see there. Because yeah, the current version is Alpha 19.3. So this is a really, really old build. And I haven't actually got into it to explore what's going on here. So from first impressions, this is quite a slow, like a slow game. So, oh wow. Oh, and they've got all of the options here. That's pretty interesting, because in the latest build, you can't get carbon dioxide and organics anymore. You used to be able to get organics, but I've never seen an option for carbon dioxide before. So, interesting stuff, actually, because I've never had the option to play of carbon dioxide since I started playing. Because I started playing in, I think it was 2015, I want to say, or 2016. It's definitely one of those two. And, yeah, there was no area to add carbon dioxide in the materials area, so... Pretty interesting stuff, so I wanna. I actually wanna check out if there's any music. So everything here is so weird, like all the. It's completely, just completely different. Okay, so there is audio, but it doesn't seem like. I'm assuming back in the day they had some issues um, running the simulations when it was playing, because it, when I play it, it's fine, but when I pause it, oh sorry, when I pause it, it's fine, but when I play it, it's really, really slow. So I'm assuming the asteroid belt here is the main issue. I wonder if I can use the current controls to delete. Oh, I can. I just deleted it. Well, okay, that's. Let's try and play it. And there's also one thing, it says no music, which kind of sucks. I love the Universe Sandbox music. Wow, the time speeds up a lot quicker, damn. That speeds up very, very fast. Alright, so, as we look here, all of the options are completely different as well. It's, it's pretty cool. Oh, the sun has a noise. That's like the normal noise it usually has, so we can edit it. Oh, it looks so weird like this, because there's any music. So, yeah, this game must be very, very weird at some point. Um, what's up with Mercury here? Let's go on here. Okay, so I want to actually have a play around with this and see if anything's different. From from what I've seen, if you actually um, mess around with this enough, like, so let's say add some hydrogen, I think the actual planet goes... Um, I think it like looks different when you add gases. Oh, see, look at that. That's a cool effect that we don't get. Look at that. That's cool. So it's like almost... It's not a gas giant yet, but you can, you can basically see the clouds, but the surface below. I really wish they did this in the current game, because that's pretty cool. So... You can still sort of see the surface below there, but you also have this cloud layer. It's so cool. So let's just actually speed this up a lot. We'll do it with all the planets as well, just to see all of the different looks. So let's completely fill it up with hydrogen and see if it completely changes. So we're at 100% hydrogen now, but is anything going to happen, I wonder? So is it going to warm up? We can um, speed up the time here as well. So is anything going to happen? Oh, it's warming up. Whoa, whoa, it is. Was it warming up? Oh, no, no, it's not. Okay, it got cold for some reason. So it's now it's a gas giant. So that's... Pretty, pretty interesting stuff there, so let's pause it again. Pause, please. Is it? Is it pause? Pause. Come on, pause. Um, I think it... We